Hello guys. This is the Auto World channel where you can find news, reviews, comparisons, curiosities, everything about the automotive world. Today we're going to bring a top 10 video, but not in an order from the worst to the best, we're going to nominate the 10 best cars and trucks for this year of 2021. Our yearly awards sift through a competitive market of more than 300 cars, trucks, SUVs, and vans to identify the 10 that provide amazing value and a terrific driving experience while staying true to their mission. If you're anything like us, you don't have nearly enough commas in your account balance to make your dream garage a reality. However, balancing your interests with your obligations does not have to mean driving a dull car. Three cars with starting costs under $30,000, a full-size truck, a three-row family hauler, and the greatest deal among luxury automobiles are among the winners this year. Of course, we have sports vehicles as well three of them to be exact. Our method for selecting the 10 best is straightforward. We begin with a $90,000 price ceiling and invite the most promising automobiles that are new or considerably different from the previous year's competition. We also invite back the champions from the previous year to defend their crowns. Any newcomer who wants to compete with the top will have to outperform at least one car that made the 2020 cut. We examined and assessed 57 candidates over the course of two weeks, focusing on their value, enjoyment, and purpose fulfillment. The 10 who brought home prizes do a better job than anybody else right now of living true to these principles. This list is a good place to start if you're looking for a new car. If you stick to your plan, you'll come out on top. The Corvette is a timeless performance value. Its 2.8 seconds 0 to 60 mph time falls between the 2.7 second Ferrari 488 Pista and the 2.9 second Porsche 911 Carrera S, but its basic price of $59,995 is comparable to half-ton trucks and tarped-up Jeep Wranglers. The mid-engine Corvette's elegance and adaptability, on the other hand, are truly astonishing. It's also a coupe that may be used as a convertible on occasion. The Targa roof is removed by releasing three latches. Alternatively, you may keep the roof up and put two sets of golf equipment in the rear. In a supercar, you can't do that. Genesis has already received two 10 best awards in its four years of existence. Even though the broader public has no idea what to make of the brand, it clearly has our attention. The GV80 is the car that should finally place Genesis on luxury consumers' shortlists, thanks to its dominating presence, luxurious interior, and sophisticated driving characteristics. The optional twin-turbocharged 375 HP V6 offers powerful acceleration without raising its voice too loudly, and the ride quality balances comfort with agility. The GV80 is a tempting luxury SUV at any price, but it's much better when the price starts at around $50,000. You get recognized by aiming high and pricing low. Over 30 years ago, Lexus and Acura pioneered this approach, now it's Genesis time. We've been banging the Accord drum for a long time, this is the company's 35th 10 best win. It has recently dropped in sales, although this has nothing to do with the product's quality, since the Accord is as good as it has ever been. It's a fairly priced, roomy four-door with the smoothness of a luxury car, the precision maneuvering of an upscale sedan, and the Honda sensibility. The manual transmission is no longer available. However, we love the manual in the first place, since it added to an already excellent product. The Accord is so wonderful that we believe one should be parked in almost every driveway in the United States. The Telluride's allure extends beyond a 10-yard equipment list and a bargain price. The large Kia is a joy to drive, with its smooth 3.8-liter V6 pumping out torque and fast reflexes belying its 291 horsepower. The ride is calm and the body control is tight, bordering on sporty. The Telluride is also capable off-road when fitted with all-wheel drive, owing to a switch on the center console that locks the front-to-rear torque distribution at 50-50. This SUV is better than it needs to be on the trail or the road. This is a common description for Telluride. The Mazda CX-5 fits the compact crossover description, 
yet it's a 10 best winner because it's full of the things that make us love automobiles. In this class, its sleek design, attractive interior, and rich paint are apparent differentiators, but it's the driving experience that elevates it. The controls on this crossover are light and responsive, and they bring the crossover to life. The CX-5's brilliance is that it surpasses its class in a segment that doesn't necessarily share our ideals. It has the look and feels of a sports car, but it's also functional, polished, and well thought out. Even those who are unconcerned will see the difference. Driving a Porsche Boxster or Cayman is to experience the peak of driver car road connectivity. It's to have a degree of assurance behind the wheel that only a few automobiles can provide. It's to understand how enjoyable and exciting the act of driving can be. Year after year, Porsche has improved these mid-engine two-seaters, and they've already won 2210 Best Awards in some form or another since 1998. You could have a hard time fitting a Boxster or Cayman into your garage due to the price. But every fan owes it to himself or herself to find a way to get behind the wheel of one of these incredible sports vehicles, even if it's only for a few minutes. So that you too may truly appreciate what is excellent. The Macon may appear to be an SUV, but it does not drive like one. It can be hustled like an enormous hot hatch since it is smaller and more nimble than the Cayenne. Although you sit higher off the ground, the Macon turns with dexterity and flexibility that belies its form and stance. The Macon's 10 best award is limited to V6 vehicles, as it has been in prior years. The 375 horsepower GTS is our favorite of the bunch, thanks to a combination of thunderous performance, a supple ride, and steering that feels and steers like a Porsche sports car. With such a diverse set of skills, a single Macon can easily transform your single car garage into a multi horse stable. Ram has successfully domesticated the American workhorse by creating the finest pickup for the way most of us use trucks today, as everyday transportation rather than a special purpose tool, carrying people rather than freight, and on suburban streets rather than farm fields. On smooth roads, even the desert running, dune bashing 702 HP Ram 1500 TRX is surprisingly enjoyable. Instead of squishing and pitching and rolling around in traffic, the TRX ratchets up the rigidity of its adaptive dampers and pavement oriented driving modes giving the truck a surprising sensation of control on the road. For the second year in a row, the Super reaches our list because its already excellent value has improved. Not only does the Silky Turbo inline 6 get 47 horsepower, up to 382 HP, for 2021, but a 255 HP Turbo 2.0 liter 4-cylinder also enters the range. Both BMW-sourced engines are among the finest in their class, with the starting Supra reaching 60 miles per hour in only 4.5 seconds. All Supras have the kind of balanced handling that makes a superb rear-wheel drive sports car so enjoyable to drive. Toyota has made improvements in this area as well, adjusting the steering and fine-tuning the suspension. Last year's Champion is now an even better package, thanks to the improvements and the 2.0 model's $43,985 base price. That's how a sports vehicle becomes a long-term success. We keep rewarding the GTI because it is simply that excellent. The Jetta GLI is its fraternal sibling. A 228 HP turbocharged inline-4, VW's MQB chassis, a limited slip differential, and manual and dual-clutch automatic gearboxes are shared by these two vehicles. When you get behind the wheel of a GTI or GLI, you'll find a fun and luxurious driving experience, with each delivering a degree of sensitivity to driver inputs that most sport compact manufacturers can only dream of. Furthermore, VW does not require a single compromise in practicality in exchange for all of this loveliness. You can't deny that the GLI's starting price of $27,340 is appealing. 